Hello my lovelies, welcome to my channel. Here we are doing the middle of the month love readings. This is going to be for Aquarius, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus. Um, let's get into your reading Aquarius. I do want to mention when shuffling the cards, the Eight of Pentacles came out. I put it back in the, uh, in the deck and I reshuffled and it popped out again. So I am going to take, I'm already receiving messages, so I'm just going to get into your reading Aquarius. Now, for those of you guys that are single or have been single for quite a while, this is not going to be for everyone. But what they are showing me here with this Eight of Pentacles is that the person that's coming towards you is going to be a person that you meet while they're working. So I am definitely seeing someone coming to your door um, and they are actively working when they present themselves to you. So this could be, as an example, uh, I don't know, someone that would come to your home, whether it's like to put the cable, to put the internet, um, the mailman, uh, Amazon guy, <laughs> that type of scenario is what I'm seeing. Uh, because I'm definitely seeing someone in uniform um, knocking on your door. And it's almost like we have this funny notion of like when people are very stubborn and stuck in your, their old ways. Um, I have this uh, tendency of telling them like when spirit communicates, you can't expect, you know, spirits to bring to you a person that literally knocks on your door. It doesn't work that way. And it's funny because they're telling me for some of you guys, this is how it's going to play out. So do not be surprised if you're single, your love life is kind of shitty. And all of a sudden, this person presents themselves to you um, and you meet them while they're working and they definitely get your attention they definitely, you know, are mesmerized by you and try to get your number, etc. Like, don't let it take you aback. Embrace it. Because I feel that this is how, for some of you guys, it's almost like they're showing me like this, you know, this person coming to your door, ringing your doorbell, you opening the door, and they're there in uniform giving you some type of package or something. Um, it could be also a, you know, metaphor for spirit saying they've heard you they know exactly what it is that you're looking for what you're trying to draw in and that's exactly what's going to be presenting themselves to you so let's get into your reading okay that's all <laughs> everything that came from this eight of pentacles all right my lovelies let's get into it see <laughs> all right so eight of pentacles this is your energy aquarius i see you guys focused i see you guys really putting effort towards uh, growth towards advancement for some of you guys I'm hearing like really money motivated or trying to grow um, trying to you know become very financially balanced with that ace of cups this is a person that's coming towards you or the person you're dealing with ace of cups is a love offering but it also indicates new love coming in so I feel that the messages are not far from what they just said with the eight of pentacles um, this is new love. This is a new opportunity for some of you guys, those of you guys that have been in a long-term committed relationship. It could represent the, you know, the strengthening of this unionship, uh, getting deeper with one another, or fully being emotionally invested and willing to put the effort um, towards seeing this turn into something long-term. Now, I also do see here the King of Cups. So you may be dealing with a water energy, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. Again, this is a person that is emotionally open. This is a person that's ready to give you all their love. You know, the, the Ace of Cups is that of love overflowing, emotions. Um, again, a new beginning. And it's almost like a message from spirit, right? With the dove up here. Um, be ready because the person that is coming towards you is a person that is going to be emotionally invested. This is the King of Cups. This is a person that is very emotionally mature. It's a person that is not into playing games. It's a person that is willing to embrace the fact that you're independent or that you have that independent spirit that is willing to give you um, your time, your space, not be clingy. This is a person that is mature enough to understand that being in a relationship doesn't remove your individuality. This is someone that is willing to embrace each other's individuality uh, to fully have a deeper connection. Um, and the relationship itself is being represented with the King of Pentacles. So this is a very highly strong emotional connection here. Now, your next card here is the Prince of 
pentacles so this is the page of pentacles the advice here is try the best you can to really take it slow aquarius um so when i say take it slow this is about being proactive um this is about being consistent um perhaps in the past you know you've gone above and beyond putting effort in relationships that perhaps the person wasn't reciprocating that type of energy and what they're telling you is finally a person is coming through that is going to be giving you that type of reciprocation this is a person that is willing to go the extra mile if you're willing to go the extra mile um with taking it slow this is indicating genuinely getting taking the time to genuinely get to know each other like really know each other um not based on physical not based on passion but genuinely getting to know the person to understand do you really like them um do you really enjoy their company that type of energy and again this can also represent a person that is very slow in the progress of um so i see them very assured i see them knowing exactly what it is that they want but it could be the type of person that takes baby steps so it could be a person that if again if they ask you for your number or you're getting to know they really take the time like texting communicating getting to know you better to be able to like take it to the next level what i'm also hearing is you may be the one to be tempted to take the first step towards like kissing is what i'm hearing so so this could be a person that's very much in their head as well when it comes to like um getting physical or touching a person and it could be that you kind of feel a bit frustrated because they're not moving as fast as you would want but again embrace this aquarius because i feel that the more you embrace it the stronger the bond becomes where you genuinely take the time to get to know one another beautiful beautiful reading here and again we have the higher fun here so there is a higher form of commitment that's coming through for you guys now if you are currently in a relationship again there is a deepening of this connection there is uh, really being on the same page and being in sync with one another um this is having the same determination or putting the same energy and focus towards accomplishing goals together as a team uh, and this is definitely drawing you guys closer and the likely outcome is that of higher commitment here with the hierophant so beautiful reading aquarius i wish you guys the very best and we'll see each other soon bye